Hey everyone, so I hope you're all calm because I'm going to be reviewing the Body Shop Aloe Calming Sheet Mask and this is going to be enriched with Community Trade Hand fill Filleted Aloe Vera from Camp Chi, Mexico and after 15 minutes, sensitive skin will feel hydrated, settled, and soothed. This is biodegradable. It's got an amazing package design that looks so refreshing when you look at this. You can take this mask on the go when you're on a road trip, um, bored at work for your lunch break, just hanging out at home, on a plane, wherever. And this is 100% vegan, fragrance-free, color-free, and alcohol-free. This will calm your skin and it will help settle sensitive skin from external aggressors with Calm Sheet Mask. Formulated with community trade organic aloe vera, known for its soothing properties, the fragrance-free and alcohol-free mask is the perfect choice for sensitive skin for an instantly soothed feeling 24 hours of hydration. Simple to use this, all you have to do is use this twice a week on cleansed skin, combined with the soothing day cream if you have it. And after four weeks of using the Calm Sheet Mask twice a week, the overall appearance of skin is improved, skin will feel at peace, and the skin will look healthier. Now this mask is for really sensitive skin, so if your skin is super sensitive, even with the vitamin E, and if you have like celiac disease um, where you can't use the vitamin E because it has um, wheat-based products, you want to use the aloe. It's really good for rosacea skin, um, even acne skin. If you do use aloe and acne, it's very soothing to it, especially if it's inflamed. So. This mask is also good for dry skin if your skin's very dry or it's aged or you're really not looking to try out any of the um, other intense ingredients. Um, I don't have sensitive skin myself. My skin is very hardy, um, hence why I'm able to do a lot of the stronger skin treatments. But um, aloe is very healing and I think that everyone can benefit from it. My actual skincare line that I use um, daily is aloe vera based and I've noticed that even using an aloe vera based line for a month your skin is rejuvenated. If you can't afford a skincare line I heard from an expert that if you slice open an aloe leaf at the store and rub the gel on your face it's really good for your skin. So I'm going to just pop this open. I'm not expecting it to smell heavily. I have used your aloe vera mask and I can say the aloe vera mask is incredible. I use it twice a day when I'm doing um, or healing from a very strong TCA peel or a very strong vitamin C peel and it helps the shedding process go a lot better and it helps to hydrate the skin while you're going throughout it. So I'm gonna open this up. It kind of smells sweet, almost like a little bit like a cucumber smell, um, which is pretty cool. And it is a little bit more drippy, so be careful of that. I think this might be like the loosest consistency next to the seaweed one. Okay, let's slide this over. And again, any excess stuff on the mask, you can just rub into your neck area to treat that area. And you'll have some residue left in the packet. Feel free to use that all over after you process your mask. So I'm gonna go chill out, watch a good movie for 15 minutes. I'm gonna go probably a little bit longer and I'll see you guys after I'm all done. All right, so I finished using the Body Shop's Aloe Calming Sheet Mask and I have to say that it was incredibly relaxing. My skin feels super soft and hydrated. Look at that, that nice glow you get from fresh hydration. It's very similar to doing like a hydrofacial because you're putting all that nice ingredient in your face and um, plumping it up. Aloe will plump your skin up much like cucumber will because it's putting all that moisture back in. And when you moisturize your skin, it will just go nice and uh, plump. If you do have dry skin, you're gonna notice that you're gonna look a lot younger after using this because with dry and aged skin, there is a huge difference. Aged skin is a lot different, but they look similar in a lot of regards. If you're not experienced with skincare, it's very hard to tell the difference. So I definitely recommend this product if you're on a long trip and you just want to relax. Um, because this mask has practically no scent, you don't have to worry about something that is going to be too strong for your nose or potentially offending someone else while you're traveling. Although all their masks don't smell that strong and they actually smell very nice. 
Um, you will be left with a lot of serum in here to use as you see fit. So whether you want to put more on after it or use it after a microdermabrasion, chemical peel, totally up to you. Uh, great gift for someone who is vegan. And other than that, I think it's a great product. I recommend this. It's cruelty free. It's super relaxing, nice little stocking stuffer. I definitely rate this product um, a five out of five stars because they are really premium. These are actually really comparable to the um, liquid masks, but because you don't want to take a liquid mask on a plane and you know, have to take all that stuff out or check it in, this is a lot more safer and easier to use um, when you're getting through security when air traveling um, or just on the road. No other maintenance is required with this. You can do as many sheet masks as you want. Aloe is a do no harm, but you get a lot of benefits for um, its properties. I actually grow aloe. I have three aloe plants. One of them I've had since 2015 about, and the other one I got back in 2016 for my 21st birthday. My friend, amazing friend Kara um, and Caitlin, um, who I absolutely love, got me those two plants and I've kept the plant going strong since. Aloe will help you with sunburn. It has a natural little SPF in there as well. Um, so if you get a sunburn, you'll put the aloe on it and it helps to rejuvenate the skin and it will get rid of it. It stops the burning sensation. I've used it for sunburn and sun poisoning. Um, great for wound healing, cuts, scar tissue. It's just an all around great herb that you can use. And I take aloe water internally because it helps um, kill ulcers. It's a natural antibacterial. It's got antibiotic properties in it. So externally and internally, aloe is one of those herbs that you cannot get enough of. So other than that, um, it's a great product. Let me know down below if you guys have tried the sheet mask, um, the aloe sheet mask, or if you've tried any of the aloe products that are in the Body Shop's line, or if you guys grow aloe at home like I do. I personally love cactuses and succulents and I cannot get enough of aloe. So I'll see you guys soon. That is the last of my sheet mask. Um, you know, Journey, I've tried every single one of them, and my favorite thus far is I'm torn between the Vitamin C and the Drops of Youth, but because I am biased to the Drops of Youth, I'm going to go with that one being my top one. But I like them all. So I'll see you guys soon with more videos.